रिवॉल्ड अराउंड क्रिकेट तो एक दिन मैं उनको मिला थर्सडे की बात है मैंने बोला कप्तान साहब बड़े परेशान लग रहे हो कहता यार मैं बहुत परेशान हूं मैंने कहा कप्तान साहब क्या हुआ यार इतने परेशान कहते क्या बताऊं यार मेरी मेरी बीवी विकेट कीपर के साथ दौड़ गई कहता मैं इतना परेशान हूं मैं बता नहीं सकता मुझे समझ में नहीं आती संडे को विकेट कीपिंग कौन करेगा With that, I want to do. I want to let you know we have an exciting evening. We're going to have Ganesh, our president, give his share his thoughts with us in a few minutes. We're going to have an award presentation. We're going to have a guest of honor who's going to share their thoughts. We have a musical performance, a magical performance, and a. A dance at the end, so we can all have a good time, enjoy, have fun. So today, tonight is an evening when we all need to just forget what happened last year, just remember the good times, have fun, and we're going to dedicate this evening to two things. One is acknowledge the teams who really did an outstanding job, and secondly, the people who are in the background who make all this happen, make it happen. And with that, I want to extend my special congratulations to our champions, Division D Cougars 2. Are you guys here? All right. Division C Spartan. Division B was Valley 2. And Division A Cougars 1. Okay, why are we here? What are we doing here? Obviously, we're here to give out these trophies, but what I want to do is take a moment to remind you that we had a good time. We enjoyed cricket in India, we have played cricket over here, but what is the next step? In my opinion, in my humble opinion, the next step is to create an environment, to create opportunities for our next generation cricketers right here, who have been exposed to cricket through their parents, to their family. So what can we do to make it a special environment for them so they can cherish, they can have a good time, and they can learn the sport? I want to invite my next generation cricketers, come on to stage and join us. Come on guys, come over here. Okay, these are the kids. Stay here, stay with me, kids. You know, you may think that you may think that this is a small group, but I can tell you they are very enthusiastic. They are an amazing group of people. And I also want to invite Rajesh, Sarabjeet, Sanjeev. Sorry. It's been a couple of months ago. Yeah, And uh, my my friend Rocky was actually vacationing in Canada with his entire family and I got a call from him saying that we're gonna be here we're gonna be here for another week but my kid has my son Bowie right here has a tournament 
That's going to support the force the parents are giving us. And the reason I have these kids over here is because, because you know, and I'm going to ask him to come join the Cougars together. I got everybody. Now, um, can I stay here for a moment? I'm going to invite our president, Ganesh, to come join us. I know he wants to hand out the trophy for the under-19, uh, under-13 uh, team, the runners-up trophy. And also, once he does that, then Ganesh is going to share his thoughts. And She was calling you. Uh, Priyanti. Okay, guys, take a seat. Thank you so much for joining me on the stage. Uh, I would like to ask you guys to give a big round of applause to all our NCCA youth cricketers. I can hear you guys. Jude, Jude, NCCA Jude, we like to call them. Uh, for those who don't know, our uh, uh, Northwest Region NCCA and 90 team won the uh, second uh, uh, national title in four years. So one big round of applause to our NCCA and 90 boys winning the national championship. Thank you very much. And, uh, now it's time to start inviting or, or welcoming all our uh, NCCA club members. It's a pretty big uh, turnout today. Thank you very much for showing up. Uh, uh, NCCA youth, representatives of East Bay Cricket Club, the NCCA youth in the back, Valley Cricketers, Sunnyvale Cricket Club, Cougars Cricket Club, there you go. Uh, uh, members of the Santa Clara Cricket Club, uh, uh, members of Spartan Cricket Club. Right, we also have uh, representatives from California Cricket Academy. Thank you very much for accepting our invitation. Uh, I'd like to welcome um, uh, more members of the NCCA Youth uh, Fraternity as well as the backbenchers. Jagdeep Singh, you doing all right? Yeah. So I'm not going to take a whole lot of time, uh, ladies and gentlemen. There's a lot of effort put together on, on, on our youth cricket program. Uh, we have uh, two full-fledged youth cricket programs going on in the uh, Union City, one camp in Union City, uh, very well led by Rajesh Sutar and uh, Sarajit Chadda. And another camp, very good, uh, you know, successful camp going on in Santa Clara, led by Rajesh Singh and uh, 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 Jagat Singh Ji. I'd like to invite Rajesh Sutar and Rajesh Singh to come on over and share a few thoughts, uh, uh, their thoughts with everyone about how they've been helping NCCA. Now these two are my left and right hand as far as the youth cricket is concerned. One is Rajesh Sutar and uh, one is Rajesh Singh and I would like to ha ha have them share a few of their thoughts. I, I am left handed so I'll go on the left side. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here. Uh, most of us, it's been difficult to drive around Sunnyvale and Santa Clara area and not see cricket going around during the weekends and especially during the summer. And why summer? Even during the winter, I see a lot of tennis ball cricket going around. So with that in the backdrop, I think Ganesh and some of us put out a call for participation for the kids in Santa Clara. And the response we got was simply overwhelming. And these were kids like, from all different age groups, under 13, under 13, a mix of boys and girls so that made it more exciting. And the yeah, go, go. love and passion and interest they brought to the game was simply amazing. So we got thankless number of support from parents, volunteers, coaches, and I'm not even going to start naming any one of them because I know I won't do justice. I'm going to miss many of them. We 
what happened after that and continues to happen is a classic example of what we can achieve collectively as a team where no one cares who gets the credit. And that's the that's amazing part and that they are building that team spirit right then and there. We teach, we coach, we mentor, we build what stays together and we try to motivate.